Today, we're diving into the ultimate hack to compress your PDF files without losing quality. This simple trick will save you tons of space and make your workflow smoother. Let's get started. Number 1. SmallPDF.com We'll start by using an online tool. I'm on SmallPDF.com, but there are many other services available, like ILovePDF.com and PDFCompressor.com. Using this website is simple, just drag and drop your PDF file into the interface. Once uploaded, you can see the original file size, which in this case is 3 megabytes. There are a few compression options available, basic compression, which reduces the file size slightly, and strong compression, which reduces it the most. However, keep in mind that this service only offers one free use. This is perfect if you just need to compress a single document. But if you have multiple PDF files to compress, the next tool we'll look at is completely free. You can install it on your PC and compress as many files as you want, with the added benefit of not having to upload your PDFs to the cloud. After clicking the compress button, you'll see that the file size has been reduced to 1 megabyte, which is significantly smaller, and the quality remains quite good. You can then click download to save it to your computer. Number 2 pdfgear.com. Next, we'll explore an app that lets you compress PDFs directly on your PC without needing to upload them online. And the best part is, it's entirely free. Head to pdfgear.com, which not only compresses PDFs but also allows you to edit, convert, sign, and annotate them. Simply click the free download button, and once installed, you'll be taken to the main interface. At the top under, Hot Tools, you'll find the option to compress a PDF. Clicking on it opens a dialog where you can drag and drop your files. Just like before, let's drag in the PDF file. You can choose the compression level from the drop-down menu, high compression results in a smaller file size but might reduce quality, while low compression gives a slightly smaller file size while maintaining better quality. Let's go with high compression. With the settings in place, let's click Compress. The file is now compressed and has been reduced. Let's check the quality, overall, it looks good considering how much space we saved. That's a wrap. If you found this video useful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more valuable tips. Share your experiences and questions in the comments below. See you next time.